If you'd like to introduce yourself, and which college did you come from? Uh, my name is George Little, George Torman Little. Um, I came from Royal College of Arts. Okay. Would you talk about the subject matter of the, the work that you have in the show? Sure. Would you? Uh, there's two images in front of me there. Mm. Um, one's a painting Entrance and one's an image. Mess up of the Holy Palette. Mess up of the Holy Palette, okay. I mean, what I, I ended up through the kitchen sink at the application uh, with a white, with like a loose version of the whole idea of the project with performance, video, not video, a snippet video, painting and an installation, all quite, the paintings were the only things that were tangibly fixed in their, mm -hmm. in their measure and in their kind of weight. And so it's, so, I mean, the entrance was, uh, was the idea of designing, um, or it's a combination of mixing the idea of how a, an artist presents his studio or how the studio exists and how a painter is so involved with the resting times and like painting sitting in his studio in relation to how what the position of an entrance to a restaurant or the entrance to a restaurant is and what kind of impression that makes so I with this with the piece the entrance it's part of my f old um, studio carpet mm. from the floor with all the splats and the remnants with this um, a, a kind of what is it it's a a copper jelly mold, which I've sandblasted, which becomes this abstract kind of bubbling shape on on the surface of it, and that that drag around gives the impression of a space, or it gives the impression of an entrance, to, or you dragged around a corner, and that in relation to the paintings, it was kind of maybe it became a thing about setting, like I was trying to build a setting for my paintings. Mm -hmm. There were kind of set ways that you can perceive a certain sort of romanticism about mm. painters. And so do you want to wear the coats of romanticism? You know, you do want to... I enjoy the, the, the holiday in, or the, 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 the enjoyment side of it, as in looking at the ideal and a, a utopian idea of a history. Yeah. And I, I do enjoy that, but it's, I think it's quite a tourist-based it's a tour, so you're, you're, you're visiting, visiting for a short amount of time. Yeah. So you won't go into the drinking of bacon. You know, you won't work. Well, it's not, up to you, really. I'm not going to be smearing lard on my paintings anytime soon. Right. But okay. I will enjoy using things like replicating aspic, which is a French jelly, mm -hmm. within as, as a glaze within a painting. So it's more kind of a, a maquette or a prop so forming system rather than fully uh, indulgent gorging gluttony. Gotcha. Which okay. is, I, I think... So we're using food analogies here. I have a habit of doing it you, constantly, and we a habit of any lecture or conversation I've had, they, with the art world, the, there's a complete falling into these... Um, what I mean, the joke one that I've once been told was, what's at stake? What's at stake, okay. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> one, um, one, one more question. The, your involvement, is that um, important to you I, I, at this point in your career? Involvement? Yeah, in within the, the New Contemporaries. Definitely. I mean, I, I had a quite a funny relationship with the, before setting up the Liverpool show where I was uh, cycling to Copenhagen on my own and ended up having these brilliant conversations with Rebecca and Cullen and Richards who were curating the show where they would be bouncing back photos and emails while I was cycling. So there was a real enjoyably close relationship that you were having. If there wasn't, I passed the work over, then I walk a step away backwards, three steps. And did you, when you were studying, did you anticipate a boundary? Did you anticipate that there would be a wall that you hit I, that would be very difficult to kind of traverse over after the education? I think I did, actually. I, I, with shows with these names around it and the, and the historicised weight of buildings like this, I felt there would always be a, a gap, but I didn't, I didn't really see the people who are between who make, who close that up. Uh, yeah, they're, 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 you know, there's a lot of people out there who want to help, you know, mm. the next generation. You know, I think it's just important that, mm. you know, you keep everything moving in a, in, a, in a single direction. And so in a way, you know, this is a very useful, uh, important show to, to allow, allow that to happen. So it's useful that it's, it's good to know that it's still working in that respect. It was nice to see Liverpool as well. And it's always nice to, to see Liverpool, yeah.